Hey, uh, today we will uh, uh, flush the uh, old uh, radiator coolant in our A A92 Corolla. And we figured since uh, Gabby and Chuch, they don't have uh, homeschool today, so uh, uh, they can be a much of a help with me. So Gabby, uh, the things that we need first is a uh, 19 uh, size wrench to, you know, uh, flush the water the old water and coolant from the radiator and there what's it? the coolant show them the coolant gabby yeah. yes thanks gab uh we're using this uh uh kind of coolant for the radiator and um, also uh mechanics highly recommend uh, the use of the distilled water yeah. distilled water we will use distilled water to according to them we are uh, uh, to avoid any um, uh, getting it rusted or rusty. All right, so first we will use this 19 size, uh, 19 inch wrench to flush our radiator. Together with me are my helpers. See that? See that part? This is the the plug that we will uh, uh, take off, and we will flush the water from the radiator from uh, that spot. Okay. And actually, after using the 19-inch wrench, you can just loosen it using your fingers. Yeah. Counterclockwise, just to make sure. And also, don't forget to put a basin underneath this to catch the, the used coolant or water. There. There's the water. We're flushing it. You can easily see it when you open the red cap here. There's a brownish uh, residue, so it means that you need to flush your old water. Make sure you're using uh, distilled water and coolant to avoid getting it rusty. A92 Corolla, we need to, all you have to do is just uh, take this off for us to clean the reservoir. Just pull it. You're pulling this out uh, from our A92. It's not that hard uh, for you to clean this uh, reserve. All I have to do is just uh, shake it a little bit and pull it up. And voila. Drain it. We will drain it. And of course, clean it. You can use brush, shake it, with some soap, just to be sure. We are just using this tap water for cleaning, just for cleaning, okay? We're not using it as a coolant because it's not good for your radiator and your engine, of course. We're just trying to make sure we're draining all okay. those rust. See that? Let it drain, let it drain. Make sure all those uh, water are drained, fully drained. And uh, yeah, we're ready to clean it. Used to have some rusty res residues in here. And I even used my finger, you know, to take off those uh, rust. Let it drain for a while. And after draining that water, we get to put the plug back. All right, just don't forget, don't use to, I mean, don't use the uh, wrench to tighten it. Because it happened to me before I used the wrench and I over tightened it. This one here. So I, I actually uh, broke it. A good thing it has two plugs. So uh, I can still, you know, uh, use this other side of the plug Tying it with your finger. Just make sure it's snug And that should be fine. That's it Okay We're good Time to put, put the reservoir back Where it's supposed to be 
there's this lock i mean there's that lock you can see that make sure it slides in it all right make sure it's not wiggly all right and we will fill that up with the coolant uh it's a mixed coolant ready to use and we will fill this up with uh, our main event which is the distilled water i don't know if you can hear my my daughter in the background she's singing upstairs i know weird and funny right but i think it's a good background for my uh for this vlog the place in the water in my radiator so now we will just we will fill this up with this, uh, distilled water Next is our mixed coolant. All right, we'll fill up the reservoir with this mixed coolant, ready to use. Actually, there's a um, measurement here. You don't have to uh, fill it up up until here. You can see that in your A92 uh, Corolla, there's a line here. All right. Well, I think that's cool. It's just exactly what we need. We uh, finished the whole bottle of coolant and it's just exactly as the measurement of this reservoir needs. That's cool. This size is exactly what we need. What I normally do when I flash water and replace water coolant in my radiator in my A92 Corolla is that we uh, uh, I don't uh, close the radiator cap right away. Uh, uh, we'll s no, normally start the engine first, warm it up because uh, the water needs to circulate around the engine. All right, and sometimes we need. We, sometimes you, you will still need to. Uh, fill it again with like a little bit of uh, distilled water so all right thank you for watching and that's how we replace the uh, coolant and water in our uh, uh, Corolla a92 Corolla and uh, please like and please subscribe, like and subscribe.